I don't know about this. I don't know. So I really don't know how I want to do this. This is why professionals get paid professional money. No, I don't know what I'm doing. What's good? Yes, I'm coming back with another deck your scooter if you've seen before. I have transformed this scooter into so many different looks. I've had the sticker bomb. I've had the Plasti Dip. I've had an umbrella cover. I've had reflective strips. I've had so many things done and now I'm going for a vinyl wrap. This is a vinyl wrap right here. Boop. That is the definition of vinyl wrap. It's basically almost like, just think of it as really long sticker on a sheet you can get them custom graphics you can get it a solid color you can get it in chrome metallic alu aluminum actually i think there's like aluminum textured one uh and you can get it like a neon color it's just anything you can think of you can make it happen now vinyl wraps are usually pretty expensive you're gonna pay usually between 12 to all the way up depending if it's a design like custom design couple hundred dollars it just depends your girl she be on that sales kick i found my vinyl wrap i got three sets of five by two feet so in total 15 feet by two feet worth of vinyl wrap and i paid 16 dollars for it yeah that's how you do it and it came in these three little tubes so the usually when the basic tools you need when Making your vinyl strip is a squeegee, a uh, exacto knife, or some kind of cutting knife, and then the material. So those are the basic things you need. Now, I told you some of the basic materials like the squeegee, the knife, and the vinyl wrap, but you also want to use a heat gun. And if you don't have a heat gun, you can use a hairdryer as a substitute. This is, allows you to stretch the vinyl. The wrap itself. Okay. so. Let's let's do this. Let's get started on this because I have no idea what it's gonna come out to look. I'm gonna throw a disclaimer right here right now. I am not a professional. This is my first time doing a rap. I am not a professional. This is my first time. This is my first time. First time doing a rap. First time. So I don't know what's gonna come out. It might come out dope. It might not. Yeah, let's do this. So I really don't know how I want to do this because I'm thinking of putting it like here and then cutting it out kind of like cutting an oval right here to better match this curvature right here but I'm playing it by ear so I'm gonna cut the vinyl about halfway through the middle this is not something you really want to mess up but I'm taking that risk It's always better to have too much than not enough. So I cut out a piece I can use here. So I'm gonna use this piece first. Something I want to mention, some of you probably might think, why didn't she use the heat gun or her alternative hair dryer? And that's because I didn't have a stinching cord long enough to reach from my house to the scooter zone. Uh, so I didn't even bother using the heat requirement for this project, just to let you guys know. If any of you can't tell, no, I don't know what I'm doing. There are wrinkles in this thing that, yeah, squeezes can get out, but for the most part, you need a heat gun. Squeegee can only get you so far. I don't have a heat gun. As the girl I am, I do have a hair dryer, but I don't have a cord long enough to stretch from the house to out here. So I'm just gonna do the best I can with what I have. But from a distance, you can't tell. 
something bad. I mean, you can't tell much. You're like, oh, it ain't bad from a distance. Then you zoom in there, there you go. Oh, oh, okay. I see how this is going. But from a distance, you can't tell. And that's how I like it. Cause I like it like that. I've been like completely decided what I would do from this point. Cause I'm kind of liking the color with the white. So I don't think I want to do the full body. It would be cool. People always intrude and every time you're trying to record. But full body, what do you think? Full body or leave a little white out. Ooh, that could be cute. Little, leave a little white out. That, I kind of like that. Okay, we'll, we'll try this.
this is why professionals get paid professional money. The dog, the dog agrees with me. Uh, uh, I don't know. Okay, the thing about it is, is that I have enough wrap. I did this all in like a wrap and a half. I have enough wrap to like do it all over again. But I am pure lazy, so I don't think that's gonna happen. Maybe one of these days, but not today. Thanks for watching Roman on Wheels, aka the Romobile, and my failed attempt to uh, plastic dip my scooter. If you want to know where I got this stuff from, where I bought this from, you're welcome to check out the links below. See all the tools I uh, that you usually need. Maybe you could do a better jo job than I did. See, the front is okay. Better than okay. It's nice and smooth. It's the back that looks like uh, wrapping paper, Christmas wrapping paper. But that's because I didn't have a heat gun and I could, didn't couldn't didn't have a course long enough for my hair dryer. And I'm gonna get a lot of people saying, oh, you should have done this, or oh, you should have done that. And I'm gonna say all of that is irrelevant because this is what I did. From a distance, Roman don't look too bad. Am I right? Am I right? He looks red. It's supposed to be more of a fuchsia pinky. Pink, pink, pink. But I guess, whatever. Thank you for watching. Uh, yeah, I'll catch you guys another day. Uh, if you guys want to see more pictures of ramen, it's on. Uh, you check out either my Instagram or my Twitter, and uh, I'll see you guys later. Bye.